Hi, my name is David Torno, and this is my new Houdini Dot School class called Attributes. Attributes are the heart and soul of Houdini. So many beginners and even intermediate users stumble over the importance of knowing the ins and outs of attributes. Understanding this topic is vital to getting the most out of Houdini itself. My goal is to give you a much deeper understanding of attributes. So I have broken down this class into smaller topics. This way I can take you step by step from the core geometry component foundations to common workflows as well as reading and writing attributes from scratch. I'll take you through examples of actual attribute implementations relating to RBD, Flip, Vellum, CrowdSim, and show some viewport GL attributes. In session one you will be shown the core geometry components and how they relate to attributes. You'll also be given some clarity to confusing terminology plus learn what attribute classes and types you have available. Also covered will be a full explanation of the geometry spreadsheet, plus some tips on how you can sort through all of the data that it presents. I'll run you through what intrinsics are, how they can be accessed, and also explain what attributes are not, which is just as important as knowing what they are. In session two, I will teach you the many different ways that attributes can be created, plus the ways you can read those attributes back into your node streams. I will also take you through the world of attributes versus variables, global versus local, and explain the reasoning and history of dollar sign versus the at symbol. In session three, I'll focus solely on attribute usage in a variety of simulation setups. This will show you some tips for how a single attribute can play a powerful part in your project builds. Houdini comes packed with a lot of native attributes already built in. I've gone ahead and collected together a massive list of well over 8,000 of them for you to check out. This course is aimed at getting beginners up and running with attributes, but I will be taking you into intermediate territory fairly quickly as it's required to get a full understanding of attributes. There will be discussions of VOPS, VEX, HScript, and Python in the second session. But don't worry though, because I will also be showing you many of the native SOP attribute nodes which simplify many common tasks for non-coders. I've packed a lot of information into this class, so even if you are an intermediate user to begin with, there is still plenty of good information for you as well. For more info and to enroll, head over to houdini.school today.